Beginners, before you draw a line on that paper, we will tell you our mistakes that you might also be making in the beginning of your art career and how to avoid them. Number 1. Tracing Most beginners are reportedly seen tracing their favorite images provided by various artists around the globe. While tracing is generally an unacceptable feat in the art community, some say that tracing is a justified act for beginners because they are trying to figure out where and how to start their career in their first few weeks. As a public service announcement, aspiring artists are advised not to share their traced artwork and must be solely used for self-study. As an artist, I declare myself guilty of this habit as well. It took me around 1.5 years of tracing and eventually had to remedy the bad habit after experiencing one of the symptoms of photocopying. According to the art journal, people who are allegedly long-term tracers experience symptoms like social reputation damage, anxiety to learn something new, and a chance to face legal charges against stolen fame. The art journal highly encourages every beginner to learn the fundamentals of drawing as soon as you begin your artistic journey. And that opens up the gate to the second report. Number 2. Not taking tutorials or art courses Research shows that beginners who don't take art classes nor watch art tutorials result in postponed mastery. Studies show that frequent study, learning new lessons from art classes and tutorials, builds self-confidence, knowledge, and creative freedom. There are hundreds of online videos and materials available for every artist like Skillshare, Gumroad, and personal coaching. According to the law of creativity, all artists are required to attend or watch fundamental art courses to reach the level of mastery easier. One voice reporter who is currently reporting this matter ironically pleaded guilty in court after police investigations found no evidence of artistic course materials in his safe house. Said reporter was given two years behind bars and was offered parole by the creative judge. Number 3. Trying too hard In December 2017, the same voice reporter from the previous report allegedly neglected creative curfews imposed by the Department of Creativity. The mentioned voice reporter was charged with hefty fines as the reporter was fixing his anatomy and adding more icing to his old abhorrent drawings. After thorough investigations, the National Forensics Agency officially confirmed that the reporter was actually trying too hard to draw perfectly. In the end, the voice reporter was filled with regret. The law of creativity states that no form of magnum opus is perfect. In other terms, Bad drawings are eventually good drawings when artists take their practices and studies regularly and seriously. The law also mentioned that there is no reason to invest more than enough time and energy to create the perfect masterpiece. Art is all about creative freedom and having fun with the process. On to the next one. In tonight's broadcast, we will tune in to Art Senpai, a certified longtime anime specialist who is joining us here live on YouTube Studios to voluntarily document his mistakes as a beginner. Art Senpai, what were the three mistakes you made as a beginner and what form of advice you would give to your kohais? The first mistake is definitely not touching myself enough. Senpai, you are on the news. Please be serious. No, no, I don't mean it that way. What I meant to say was, um, I did not understand our anatomy, bone structure, and muscles well enough. You could have just said this first. When I first started drawing hand, I mean illustrations, I did not know that our clavicle was actually bent, not straight. So now, whenever I see my clavicle when I look at the mirror, I just couldn't forgive myself for drawing them wrong this entire time. You know, we're blessed with this amazing body as humans, and the least you can do is understand every inch of it clearly. And this is related to my second mistake. Not watching hand- Zenpai. <clears throat> not observant enough. Art is born of the observation and investigation of nature. It's by, uh, someone famous I guess. Basically, it means if you can't draw something, you're simply not observing enough. And how can you observe something that you can't draw? This leads to my third mistake, not finding reference when I draw. I was once a victim to this mistake. Back then, I wasn't the kind of person who likes to take pictures and save sugoi photos. But now, I am a changed man. I have different albums for keeping different types of illustrations, like high school girls, cat girls, bikinis, thighs, feet, <laughs> I'm afraid we cannot continue this interview any further, so I'm going to take over. Thank you GF4K Arts for inviting Senpai for the interview. We had a lot of fun, even though my Senpai is only capable of throwing hentai and making hentai jokes. Oi, what you say about me? <laughs>
Thanks for having us. Thank you so much, Art Senpai, for stopping by for this interview and making this collaboration a reality. If you enjoyed this artistic reporting style, leave a like. And make sure to check out Art Senpai's channel and subscribe to him for more animate art tutorials. As a side note, belated congratulations to him for amassing over 10k subscribers. Don't also forget to subscribe to my channel for more weekly art headlines. A final note to all art beginners listening to this cable broadcast, we hope you never repeat or commit any of these mentioned mistakes we ever made. Have a great day or night. GF4K Arts reporting!